The process for picking the winner is usually a two-tier system. In the first round, I will send the essays to my colleagues at Science. Once we have picked the top group, we will then invite um, external judges. So my research is all about understanding how the brain gets all the nutrients that it needs to grow and function properly. But to get into the brain, these nutrients have to cross a protective layer of cells called the blood-brain barrier. And they do this by interacting with specialised proteins called transporters that act as special doorways for certain molecules that have been marked as safe for the brain. My research involves studying the role of neurons in the spinal cord in the recovery of motor function after paralysis. I've always been extremely fascinated by how spinal neurons produce coordinated motor functions, such as walking, which is incredibly complex. So my research involves understanding how external threats that enter our airways are detected. So you and probably many others watching this video will have had the experience of water going down the wrong pipe, or maybe you've even had a stomach acid come up and been refluxed into your airways. So when these substances enter your airways, you have this immediate and strong reaction where you start swallowing and coughing. And I found that neuroendocrine cells within our uh, trachea and our larynx detect these noxious stimuli, and this activates the cell and causes them to release this neurotransmitter called ATP. And then ATP then activates nearby sensory neurons from the vagus. What really motivates me in my research is my fascination of the nervous system, how it generates complex and dynamic movements with such apparent ease, yet so much remains unknown. By understanding more and more about how it functions, we will eventually help those whose motor function is impaired. Yeah, so I first saw the ad for the Eppendorf and Science Neurobiology Prize when I was lying in bed on a Saturday morning reading the headlines of News and Science. And I thought, well, I do neurobiology, so why not give it a shot? Um, and I almost didn't put in an application actually because I was really busy writing grants before I was going to head off on a vacation to the Great Barrier Reef. I got on the plane and I was sitting there with my friend who's an MD-PhD and I was telling him about the prize saying, oh, should I spend some time on vacation doing this? And he said, oh, it actually sounds kind of fun, you know, writing up an essay about your research so it can reach a more broad audience. I was very excited to hear that I was one of the finalists because this means that my work has been acknowledged by other people in the field and that my work really can have an impact. So being a finalist for the Eppendorf and Science Neurobiology Prize is, I mean, it's really such an honour, um, first of all, um, and it's going to be a huge boost for my research. Um, it's going to get my research out to scientists from other disciplines, which to me is really important because I firmly believe that it's only through cross-disciplinary research that we can actually make groundbreaking discoveries like we've been able to do here. The jury selected Laura Seeholzer as the 2024 winner because her essay was outstanding. Right from the beginning when we started reading it, we noticed that she was really enthusiastic about her own work. There's a lot of quality that has gone in. So this prize will help my research because it is already making me a better communicator. So the exercise of writing this essay and even answering your questions has helped me think about and talk about my research in a more exciting and relatable way. So, so much of our job as a scientist is communication. So for that reason, I would strongly encourage everyone to apply no matter what you think your chances are. And I don't know if we have any people uh, watching this video who have ever watched The Office, but to quote Michael Scott, quoting Wayne Gretzky, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. <laughs>